I I know you see nothing but an eye right now, but this is going to be much more than that. Roll the intro. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so much for uh, coming back to the channel. I know that I haven't been here for a while, and I know that I haven't been doing uh, a lot of video game stuff for a while, but I'm I'm back. I've got a lot of new inspirations and a lot of new things that I want to do with this channel. I'm really excited about it, and one of them is this game in particular with uh, one of my friends. This is Alfonso. Alfonso, say what's up. Hello, world. I, I am Alfonso, also known as Solitary Cat. Feel free to follow me on YouTube, I guess. I don't post much outside of little Overwatch videos here and then, but I have been wanting Brian here to play Echo for what? Roughly half a fucking year? I want to say it's been half, about six months. Half yes. a freaking year since it's been out. I myself have seen this game in development for roughly two years now. The two years it's been pushed back but finally it's been out. Yes, it, it is out and it's ready. And I'm, I'm excited to do this because um, one of the things that I like to do is be able to introduce people to games that I love. And so now I get to be introduced to a game that Alfonso absolutely loves and adores. And so Here's... we're we're just gonna we're gonna we're gonna get into this. Tell me, Alfonso, tell me what what it is that you love about this game so much. So, uh, this game Echo was produced by Ultra Ultra. Now, little fun fact: Ultra Ultra is the new facelift and name for the people that created Hitman. You'll notice a lot of the aesthetics of the games prior. The okay. only reason why I truly do love this game is because there's no game such as this game. Now, me speaking from from my own experience, mm -hmm. being from that aristocratic background of money and glory and finesse and, yes. and elegance, you, people get to witness this in this game, the Baroque and Rococo kind of styled uh, decor uh -huh. that puts you in the world that a lot of people don't naturally experience. But they don't give you the ability to... Uh, intake it wholly because you'll figure out later in the game that you're always in danger that that is very interesting uh, also uh, obviously you know that um there's no um face face cam in this video because of the fact that um we in in talking about doing this uh uh doing this game experience we wanted to make sure that you guys were experiencing it in in this particular way of experiencing the game uh, and it's aesthetic. As correct? I've said before, Brian, there's no other game like this for myself. I honestly do believe this is what my heaven will sound and look like. And you, since you've known me for a while, yes, there's nothing out there that compares to this. That is, I'm just waiting for that <gasps> kind of reaction from you. I'm so, <laughs> I'm so excited, especially just because of the way that you talk about it. That's that's the reason why I had to have you on and play this game. And I'm so. happy to be on. Yes, so we're we're gonna do it right now. Going to start. Apparently, it's saving initially, and here we go. All right. The flesh and the soul shall enter the palace through separate doors. Only the strong of mind and body will again reunite us whole. All our songs were about it. Oh, okay. A magical place of life without end. A palace of untold. Space things. But only for the worthy. Oh, okay. So There's halfway religious things. To qualify. Pinpoint, Pinpoint perspective, perspective on the great reward. Oh, listen to that. Anyway, yeah. I never wanted to go. Alfonso, how many times have you gone through this game? Roughly six. So six times? That's insane. I, my my favorite game, of of all time. Well, I have two, but just one of them I've been through seven times. Just listen, just listen. Okay, okay, I will. Okay. The place I spent my whole life escaping. Wow. I feel like shit. <laughs> Jesus. Your wound has healed. The pain 
is from a stasis and will pass within a week. The nausea will linger. Uh huh. Probably intensify when you start to realize that more than a hundred years have passed. Everything you knew is gone. Well, that sucks ass. Another one of your running away from home excursions. Your grandfather won't send someone to pick you up this This feels like May from Overwatch. Look at the regalia on her clothing. Yes. But you've had a century to plan on what to say, and that's it. But again, if you if you oh, think well, about the uh, uh, the past have. for for May from you from Overwatch, yes, it's like yes. this. Giving orders, or, or even Foster died because of you. You, you stupid <laughs> bitch. Okay. Look at the detail. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. The detail is insane. But I can fix this. The adornation of what she's wearing. The mm -hmm. embossment of her clothing. Mm -hmm. Now, which other game gives you the feeling of nausea, such as this camera angle right now? I want you to play around. Of nausea. Nausea. You're just woken up. You don't know what's going on. Okay. Your equilibrium is off. Okay. I'm I'm going to initially just because of the idea. I'm going to uh, equate it to the initial halo. Yes. But that's it. Little miss, but I suggest you start your efforts by laying back down. Loss of motor you can move now. Ooh. Oh. 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 Whoa. Let's face it. You had a long time to move. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay. So, this game has to do a lot with light. Yes. As you'll see. Okay. She herself is not used to it. Oh, yeah. I've had a hangover before. But also, as much as uh, utopian as the, the aesthetics go, it's uh -huh. still very aggressive. It's very raw. Look at the spaceship in itself. But look at the floor. Look at the walls. Look at the light. Well, yeah, they yeah. they put they put a lot of work into this. I uh, I felt the same way about Bioshock Infinite. Follow the light. Mm -hmm. See, same same thing when it came to uh, when it came to the initial Halo. Red, you were like, I don't want to go that way. Oh, white, I I should go that way. This is how I. That's that's uh, that's common game aesthetic to help you in where it is that you need to go. Red always means no. Also, in this playthrough, we're going to be listening to a lot of what's going on. There's going to be, uh, like, a bit of silence in in this playthrough. It's it's just so Fair. that we can experience this. Because, mind you, El Alfonso has gone through this game many a time and wants me to experience this in a, uh, in a new way, in the way that he has. Full disclosure, uh, whenever they're talking, you are forced to walk so this game in mm. itself forces you to listen right so so you can't run while no. they're talking no nope. the story is developed through their conversations as vague as they are if it's one of those how do we call it if you blink you miss it kind of things i get it yes i get it no p.s i'm i'm going to have alfonso play through one of my favorite games as well don't think this is just one-sided wrong way love oh is it is oh now right off the bat oh oh because of the because uh, of the right up right off the bat mm -hmm. listen to the score listen to the music as you're walking through okay okay even the way they deliver the credits okay so 
N is that main character. That's you. Okay, so N is me. London is your AI. It's the ship that's talking to you. Okay. All right, and then we've got the uh, designers. This yes. ooh, this is a great way to give to give the initial credits. Mm -hmm. I love this. Uh, they did they did something like this in Snake Eater, which was really really good. If you've ever played um, uh, Metal Gear Snake Eater, uh, it was amazing. And go back to what I explained: the score in itself, the violins, the cellos, the symphony, the orchestra, however you want to recognize it as. This is stuff that people within again again we'll call it in my world mm -hmm. are are exposed to the finesse the elegance of it all right here listen to that yeah listen to that okay yeah it's 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 a lot about yes that. it's very regal yes that's the cube attacking to what oh x got it we did it Oh. oh, oh, okay. Listen to that riff. Yes. Not, not to go over this, but there is, uh, there is so much money that goes into the score of a game. Yes. It's not nice. I don't know that we can even trust what we see. This. Planet eluded detection until about a week ago. No visual cues, Ooh. no gravitational pull, nothing. Even with the exact coordinates, I nearly missed it. We're looking for a pulse. Why am I not surprised? Give it a rest, will you? Can you see any structures on the planet? It's a bit of a Metroid vibe. It's all one big structure, planet wide. No palace, though. I'm guessing it's some corporate state's illegitimate mining project from the pre-requisition rush. That would explain the heavy clouding measures. The planet is most likely depleted of all resources. An empty shell. I hope the old man didn't pay too much for the coordinates. You have, have no, no idea. idea. <laughs> Just get me down there. I'll go see you myself. Jesus. The attention to detail. The simplest, the minimalism it, of it all. Yeah, it's it's so simple yet so detailed. Remember, go back to my art styling. There is elegance Which, and understatement. Yes, it draws more attention. I love it. Down to the asymmetry of the spaceship. Truth. Also, don't forget. There's times where the game will, quote unquote, freeze. It's loading. Yes. Right here. We've got a saving portion. You should get off the surface too. Okay. So, remember what I said that. So, at this point, I am I am in full control. Yes. Remember what I said that this gives you the I'm enabling the suit's assist world to compensate for your inexperience. Okay. The world gives you the visuals and everything people are not usually given access to. Uh -huh. If you pay attention to the inside of the gloves, the red. The bottom of the soles of her shoes, the red. Le bouton. What's, what's pronounced here as a very high-end, elegant kind of brand. Right. I uh, with the with the red on the back, it actually reminds me of. Uh, did you ever play Dead Space? I did. Yes, I and did. and in Dead Space, you didn't get, um, you didn't get like a full, a hood. uh, like hood or health bar yeah. in the corner. It was it was all something that was on your back, something that you had to pay attention to yes. on your character themselves. And I'm seeing that here, and I love. This it. is where they bring you into the game. Right, and I love it. It gives you it gives you a lot of. Um, a lot of paying attention to you as the character. Yes. I'm into that. Okay. So, you're finding locks. Right, exactly. I'm finding things I interact with. 
I'm going to do that. Okay. <laughs> Give it up for Mario 64 one time. <laughs> that's some shit. Like, honestly, that's something that I've done there. The suit oh. will soften your landing if charged sufficiently. And if not, it will stop you from leaping. Okay. That's good. So it's also, Ascend. we'll call it a... Uh, <coughs> It's a trick. It's a trick-based kind of game, right? Yeah. That again, that reminds me of, and I, ironically, I did two Nintendo 64 games because I did uh, Super Mario 64. But now, this is um, Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time, one of my favorite games, wherein when you can leap, it will allow you to. Exactly. And that's good. So this suit, if you could bring up that little HUD right there, push down on the direct... Oh, you missed it. The suit stores energy. See those little triangles? Those are cells. Right. Oh, okay. It's basically... There we go. The cell meter. The suit okay. stores energy in cells. In cells. The cell meter visualizes your total capacity and current charge. Massive triangles mm -hmm. are charged and hollow triangles are empty. The cell cost. Cell cost of any prompted action will be highlighted in yellow. If you don't have enough charge for the action, the empty cells needed will blink yellow. Mm -hmm. Auto charge cell. The suit's core is auto recharged, harnessing ambient energy. So you will always have one cell right. to do what you want to do. Okay, and that's 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 good. That's a very it's a very interesting situation where in like it won't um, it won't necessarily allow you to do uh, to do particular things where. It's like, well, I'm just going to do it. It's like, no, no you can't. No, 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 don't, you don't, and you cannot. You don't have enough energy to do so. Okay, so I'm. I don't feel like I should have sent it that because there's no like way to get across. I feel like I should <clears throat> do that, but I can't. No, it's one or the All other. Right. Yeah, so I've only got the two. <laughs> the two ascensions that have be prepared bridges. be okay. prepared for okay. a lot of walking I get, I, I get down with that Red Dead Redemption was that and right now a lot of story so yes Ex that's that's why we're doing excuse that. us for the silent moments but in order to follow the story you have to listen yes we're there there are going to be silent moments and these are going to be long videos that's that's just the way it's going to be right now we're already at about 18 minutes so that's just the way it's going yes, to be yes but it's it's exciting in that way a composite like that should last forever but it all looks ready to crumble hmm it must be ancient truth it's like new world uncharted slash tomb raider exactly and i'm about it okay l3 to crouch Oh, look at the detail of that cube. Oh, of course. That is that is one of the things that I love is when they there is a game that has attention to detail. Well, again, this is Ultra Ultra's first game for the new facelift. Right, you're right. This was made for humans, not just a machine. Most digs have a basic infrastructure if human presence should be needed. Probably also rudimentary living quarters. Doesn't mean anyone was ever here, though. Thankfully, the place to be untouched by humans. A palace built by long lost technology, patiently awaiting for a human inhabitant. Question is, and you say this, this is no more than a bootleg mining operation. Look around. Hmm. I appreciate the contrast. I generally oh. lean towards plausible explanations. No. Your grandfather, well, no. everything no. he believed in, he made up himself. Oh! What do we know about that? He had the coordinates right. Look around you. This obviously isn't a palace. The old man might have gotten some aesthetic details wrong. But he wasn't the kind of person who'd risk everything. There's some kind of proof. I really wouldn't get my hopes up. There, there was a... Uh... You are overconfident. Immature people often are. You should be taking notes every time I open my mouth. No, oh, see, there was a... There was a game that I played a while ago that was a... Uh was basically a uh, a tower defense type game but it had a um in overarching um ba basically like god mike type character yes yes and it this this reminds me of that wherein 
like at the beginning you're you're listening to it taking in what's going on so and you hear you're gonna hear a lot of speak of this palace right if you remember n when she was first giving her dialogue in the in the beginning you know a palace full of untold wonders yes but only for the worthy mm-hmm. so this is basically one of those things where you're trying in this specific moment in the game you're trying to find your way into this palace mm-hmm. to which in her mind she did not have a right to she did not want the right to which okay. is why it's it's a safe haven for those of the elite class oh God, this is so interesting. You see, I I understand why this is you wanted me to play this game. There's so there's so many levels to this that is so oh that are so that are so interesting when you when you like ba- basically like dissect it. It's God, it's so interesting. And even from the very beginning. I've had my fair share of halls based on wild speculation. It doesn't matter if it comes from desperate need or delusions of grandeur. There's never anything there but bitter disappointment. Was this with Foster? Before Foster. I don't feel the need to have been together for ages. I've been crisscrossing the spur for a thousand years. Oh, all right. Foster was with me for a century and a half. <laughs> Superhero landing. That's gotta be bad on the knees. I'm sorry. Yeah, but you're forgetting the suit compensates. Ah, touche. It's like it's like what was it, Metal Gear Solid? That muscle suit. Right, right, right. They they had that once. You hit four. <laughs> yeah, so keep going my way down this yep. way. It's so snowy. <laughs> oh. I get to run now. Right, a little bit of a jog. A little bit. Forget these stairs, though. It's got to... Oh, oh, God. Oh, oh, God. Why are you talking shit on the stairs? I'm sorry. I mean, see, all of a sudden, I say something about stairs, (laughs) and they want to kill me. Didn't mean to. What phone service? I apologize. Touche. Foster's longest was 16. I knew him plenty. Yeah, well, there you go. He trusted you and said that I could too. Think you would help me. Foster didn't leave me much choice. <laughs> you don't have oh, so a job for your grandfather and then oh. team up with the person who was sent out to get in the yeah. first place. You could have just handed me back. You really are naive. Why you gotta yell at me like that? Why you gotta yell at me like that, though? Fucking take off my wig already. Right? Well, I mean, I'd probably die. I warned Foster about you resourceful. Resourceful. Best not to deal with your kind. Why did you then? Get involved. Wait. So they call us resourcefuls? And gold makes for a powerful argument. So in this game, resourcefuls Uh is somewhat of a religion kind of thing. Oh! Um, um, little fun fact, if uh, depending on you people who like to do research, uh-huh. uh, they came to the belief that in 2020, maybe 2025, humans are going to adapt differently, even in stature. Our hair is going to be blonde or white. Our jaws what? are going to be thinner. Our frames are going to be thinner and slender. Because the way power works nowadays goes through money. This True. is a fun little point into her design she's slender she's her hair is blonde platinum white because that is the future keep in mind wow. this this game is set widely into the future it's yes. like thousands of years that's crazy no and and i will say uh i'll uh i'll hold right here for a second because i mean obviously i'm not in well i mean i can keep moving yeah. but for for myself, I have always hold, thought that. Hold it that, if you want. If you don't want. To. Uh, oh no, it's yeah, fine because yeah. I mean I don't have to worry yeah. about getting into trouble. But I've I have always thought that. <laughs> Sorry, we had to uh, do a quick cut, but I've always thought that, um, in initially like, 
in the in the future it would be a uh, a combination in in such a way that it was like so uh amalgamated that it just didn't um like you you couldn't really tell in any different direction and in in that this basically sort of makes sense um if if that was the way that it happened um but yeah that's that's so that's so weird I love I love I love games that give you like ideals of future. like I said this game is very philosophical in itself yes and I love I love philosophy the the next uh, set of videos that you're going to see from me on this channel will be very philosophical if you follow me on Facebook you you know that I was I was worried about doing that but I will and and am so remember like i said before play attention to this rust almost like grimy yeah. industrial design <laughs> and look how it changes drastically okay so we're gonna pull this it's stuck apparently it's stuck there's a gun back in the front uh gun right am yep. wow I like, I like it. it. Mm, all I right. The oh, there we are. Even the gunshot cost to sell. Yeah, I was gonna say that it has a very particular. That that's a big thing in Fallout, where it's like you have to you have to make sure that you take care of that. And before you start, take a moment to pause here. Okay. Just so, me, me to you. Yes. Remember what I said. This game, sound design and all is going to be my heaven you so this this is where this is where we're really going to see that when we come through this door yes 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 okay the so, world that people aren't exposed to got it so right here we're going to we're going to pause we're going to end this episode uh because this was this is a uh a long episode it's there's, a progressive game yes there's going to be uh multiple long episodes of this and I would love to start our next episode on the opening of this door. Okay. So, with that being said, thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you, Alfonso, for being here. Of course, thank you for having me. Uh, please make sure to uh, follow him on his YouTube channel. Solid, YouTube channel. Solitary Cat, Cat with the K. There we go. And uh, we will see you guys on the next video. I am so excited. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Also, um, for anybody who has been here on the channel i know that i haven't posted for a while thank you guys so much for being here and for the new people who are coming to the channel thank you guys so much for coming through there's going to be a lot of new stuff and uh it's going to be great i'm really excited see you guys soon